Oktoberfest is BMW CCA's biggest event of the year. It's a national event, it takes place at a different track every year, and people from all over North America, sometimes all over the world, will come here, take part in this event. There's a concourse, autocross, club race, driving school. We've made just about every Oktoberfest event since 2002, 2003 doesn't really matter where it is, we are going to tow there, we're going to race there, and every time we go we have fun. And when we rolled into the track this morning, it was still a little bit dark, you turn the corner and you see that mid-Ohio sign and it was just goosebumps. You've watched lots of races there and here you are, finally you have an opportunity to race it yourself. It's a track I've been trying to come to for a long time, luckily Oktoberfest was here at mid-Ohio this year. We made the trip from California and it's going really well. Oktoberfest is always fun because you get to race against guys that you don't normally get to race against. It's a good opportunity to meet new guys, new racers, and to see old friends and old buddies from the past. And it's a bit of a challenge as well because you don't really know them. Everybody's got a different line. You don't know their car. You don't know their driving style. You need to adapt to what you think is going to happen. And when you're not 100% sure about the driver in front of you or the car's capability, sometimes you need to make quick decisions and react accordingly. Getting to know that driver and the car and the competition and the dynamics of racing as quickly as possible to be as competitive as you can is something that is a challenge. You may not have ever met this guy and you don't know the car's capability, but sometimes you can just tell. Experience we've been able to pick up over the years and it's something I'm able to sometimes use to my advantage. You can have slow cars that are really optimized and the driver has some serious skills and it's a local track and the guy's just extremely competitive. We do try to win the national championship every year for our class. You need to attend the right events, you need to do well, you need to be consistent, you need to be reliable, you need to have a good team behind you and so far this year we've been lucky to have all that. There's so many cars. You are either getting past or passing a car every lap. There's elevation changes. There's different types of pavement. There's off camber, on camber. The braking zones are downhill. There's blind turns. There's cambered bank turns. It's, it's got a little bit of everything. It's really a great track. The track's similar to Thunder Hill, which is the last race that we just did. So we left the setup kind of the same. Thunder Hill is a counterclockwise track. So we flipped the tire pressures and added a couple for the cold weather and it was pretty good. The car handled really well. We came off the trailer with the car in pretty good shape. I qualified 15. There were 25 cars I was faster than. And there was a full course yellow on the first lap. So we were all bunched up. So as soon as we had a green flag, I was just able to slowly pick off a couple cars here and there. The overcast conditions were great because it helped keep the track temp down and the car was pretty consistent and handled really well throughout the entire race. Our data. Our team is really good at, at collecting and organizing data. We take data every time we come off the track. Our team's committed to BMW CCA club racing and we felt like we had to be here. 